Hi, hello, how are you? And welcome back to another video. Today we're doing another create a sim and I'm really happy with how she came out. Um, first of all, her name is Amethyst Darling and if you can't tell as the video progresses, her favorite color is purple. Um, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know where the purple came from. I just started making her and I was like, all right, as much purple as possible and then I named her Amethyst which is obvious which is a pretty obvious name but I think it works especially since as I started making her like I developed her personality and stuff in my head and she's kind of like not so much a rock star but kind of the like an indie musician and she's not afraid to do whatever she wants she's not afraid to break the rules she's just a really cool sim and so I think Amethyst works for her as a name. Despite her love of the color purple, her favorite color could one day be red and Amethyst would still work, okay? It's not just about her favorite color. But no, she is really cool. She, um, I try to give her this kind of, I don't know, I try to give her that indie music vibe and the music I think she would make is kind of a, she plays electric guitar, but it'd be, it's not like rock and roll, it's not heavy, it's just kind of soft but with a beat and she loves to dance her traits which you won't see until the end of the video but she's a dance machine she's a music lover and i think she's creative but i'm not sure and obviously she has a musical aspiration but no i had a lot of fun playing with her style because there are things like it's not super eclectic but there's just kind of that I don't know, that interesting worldly vibe about her style that made it, you had to carefully pick and choose things so that they worked well together, despite it seeming very casual. So she, I, I'm sorry, I just can't stop thinking about how much I like her. She's a really fun sim. Um, funny enough, because I, I have found this easiest way to keep all of the sims I create safe is just to add them actually to the game and not just to save them to my library. So... Amethyst is actually roommates with Samoa Scout right now just because I placed them in the same apartment. So, fun fact. But no, she, I don't know, I feel like the farther I got into her outfits, the more she developed for me. And you'll notice even when I get to her party outfit, she's wearing two different colors of eyeshadow. Like, she is ready to go. She doesn't really, I don't think she cares about what anyone thinks. I think she... I know. I feel like everything she does is like her own thing. She's not looking toward anyone else for guidance. She's like, I want to do this. I'm going to do this kind of sim. So, yeah. I don't know how much custom content she's wearing, but I know her hair. Well, her skin tone is custom content and her hair is her hair is in game. That's a thing. Her eyebrows are custom content. If anyone wants her, I will go through, like all my sims, I'll go through and I'll find all the custom content for you and make a Tumblr post. And I'll upload her to the gallery and link her and all of those good things. So if you want her, let me know. But otherwise, I am not the best at keeping track of CC, so I don't think I'm going to do it unless anyone actually wants her. Because, I don't know. I don't know about you, but sometimes I watch creative sims and I'm just content to watch them exist in the video. Because I have too many of my own sims to keep track of, let alone someone else's. But I think she'd be a cool sim to play with if you wanted to do, I don't know, if you wanted to do the music aspiration, if you wanted to play with the um, dance, or even probably the DJ skills and those kinds of things. Also, did you just see the outfit she had randomly generated for a party outfit? I feel like we just need to take a moment for that. That was... That was something else. I normal sometimes you know you get it, you randomly generate a sim or you start and you have the randomly generated sim and you're turning into your own sim and you go through the outfits and you're like okay that's pretty okay it's not the greatest but like you could deal with it you could live with it and then you see things like that and you're like oh no <laughs> it's just bad. She was rocking the vampire gear. I don't think she's the kind of sim that ha would have an issue with vampires though. She'd probably embrace it. I would say her best friend's a vampire, but as of yet, she has no friends, so <laughs> she's a new sim. You know, I really like her. She, um, I feel like she's that, she's the perfect city sim, I think, if you kind of try to base lo living locations of your sims on personalities or anything like that. 
she's very much this city sim she or at least a place that has like kind of some nightlife because she's a musician she likes dance she likes to go to the club and all that stuff but anyway this is amethyst and the video is coming to an end so i'm gonna let you go don't forget to like comment and subscribe i'd love to know what you think i'll see you in the next video bye